Hello YouTube, this is my first uh, YouTube video and I'm kind of nervous. Um, so my title was Socrates and Safe Places, the Basis of Learning. Yes, I had to look over at my screen to see what I was saying. Um, I thought it was a good place to start because um, through recent, well the last few months, I feel like I've learned a lot and it's kind of started with this idea that um, as soon as you think you you know everything, um, you can't learn. Like your knowledge in that area is completely shut off. You won't learn anything else, and you can't grow if you're not open to new ideas. And um, through a couple of books, um, I've learned that being you have to be honest with yourself, even if that's not great and that's hard, um, it's not easy, but I mean, the things you can learn is pretty impressive so far. Um, so uh, the conservative part of me even hates to say this, but we do actually need safe places, except not the ones that you're probably thinking of. Um, Right now, Safe Places is a place where, anyway, it's the antithesis of any, of any kind of environment that you can learn in. So the Safe place that I'm referring to is one where you're allowed to be completely and 100% open and honest with yourself and other people. And I mean, how else are you going to learn and realize that some of your ideas aren't great ideas actually? and you need to change them if you're not able to say them out loud and have people be like, hey, you know what, Nathaniel, that's actually not a great idea, man. Maybe you should do that. Maybe you should uh, reconsider that. Um, and it kind of reminded me of Socrates always had this quote and I didn't, like, I was like, oh, that's, you know, kind of cool when I heard it, but like, I didn't, I haven't fully like realized what that actually means until recently. Um, he says, the only thing I know is that I know nothing. And it's like, well, well, that sounds good, you know? But um, I mean, when you actually understand to have the mindset that you go around and you're open to learning like, hmm, maybe I don't have it figured out or maybe I have it mostly figured out, but not quite all the way there. like. I don't, just life is so incredibly complex. Like when you actually begin to peel back the layers, um, it's just astounding. And so any, any ideology or people who are like, oh yeah, I have it all figured out, even if it's just in one area, that's the chances are you probably don't have it figured out. You're not even close. And instead of having the attitude of revisiting that, you're just, stuck there and that's kind of where our culture is in a way <laughs> so um anyways with this youtube channel i was trying to um anyway i read a lot and i think I'll, i have time to think about a lot of things and so i thought this would be a fun place to, to kind of think about certain things and an odd you know and have an audience and so Anyway, that's my goal, and I thought this would be a good place to start with. Um, we'll see when I look back at this video if I <laughs> like it or not. Probably have to do it over again. But you don't get good at anything, or you're not good at anything when you first start out, right? So this is my probably first of many failures. Um, but that doesn't mean I'm always going to be a failure too. So hopefully it'll get better. Um, Let's see. So yeah, I thought this was a good place to start um, because my whole point of this uh, musings of a gadfly is to, you know, think about things in unpopular ways or try to dissect what you know was actually going on or the meaning behind things. So um, it'd be good f for me. Well, it's good. 
to vocalize kind of where I'm coming from and hopefully um, as some of you watch this maybe you'll um, take a moment to think about it instead of just being like oh this guy's an idiot or whatever you know so yeah um, let's see what this is like